Hello YouTube, welcome to another unboxing experience review with me, Aust. Today we finally have the AMD Ryzen uh, 9 3900X. This is uh, based on the Zen 2 architecture and I have waited for this for about a month. I ended up ordering it and then cancelling that order because a different store had it in stock. Um, so yeah, I finally have this. There will be overclocking videos and uh, settings and stuff if you want to see what it looks like and runs like on a Crosshair 7 Hero. So subscribe for that stuff. Uh, as for the unboxing experience review now, you can already see the, the main product right here. Uh, that's where the processor goes. So if you were hoping for some excitement, like, you know, you open the box and then, ooh, I wonder what's inside. There isn't going to be much of that. Because it is already well established what we're looking at. Okay. Okay, then. I, I thought <laughs> this, uh, this would be easy. But I guess they have decided to make it more difficult so we're just gonna have to exa I, I thought first you know you see these parts and then you figure oh, okay well I'm just gonna go ahead and pull that up but not the case here uh, I suppose one logical thing would be the sticker here if you remove you remove the sticker and then you would need a knife for that i imagine yeah you would have to use a knife to cut this little line here to uh yep yeah, like that a knife and then you cut this part <sighs> Good thing if you cut straight, which I did not, but uh, yeah, we will do it a couple of times and that should take care of it, like so, and then, let's see now what happens, does it actually open? I think it is supposed to. Yeah. Yeah, it's supposed to open. It is. Yep. Now it slides out. So you're actually supposed to hold it this way. There we go. Uh, this, I guess you can use as a hat if you want. This is kind of cool, uh, but not very stable. Then, we get the actual processor uh, and a sticker for that. It, it doesn't feel much heavier, even though it is 12 cores as opposed to 8, which was on their previous flagships. No uh, bent pins or anything. And we want to keep it that way, so I'm going to... Uh, be careful with that protective plastic. I'm not going to open the actual processor there because I'm going to need to be careful with it uh, so that I can install it without having to bend any pins later. And then there's this, some foam. AMD warranty, yada yada yada, and then you open this part. Whoops, this part here. But since I don't actually need the, I guess I can. I, I don't need, actually need the cooler, so uh, I 
Pretty sure I'll take it out and show you guys anyway. Yeah, I think so. I think so, because if you want to see what the cooler looks like, then where else are you going to see what it looks like? Here is the actual cooler. I'm not going to take the, the bottom part off, because you see there's uh, thermal paste and stuff. So, this is what you get in the box. It's kind of beefy and nice. But, uh, yeah. So, that's about it for the video. Uh, as usual with them, I, I would have to say, this time, uh, I will give it a 7. Because they made it unnecessary, unnecessarily complicated with the, the box there. You have to cut open and then... You think you can just slide it, and it doesn't slide, and it's it's a bit too complicated, yeah. But overall, a uh, good experience, but uh, also a bit of um, knock it down a notch because there isn't much surprise to it. You already you can already see what's in the box, um, like you see on this part over here. You can already see what's in the box, so there's no surprises really. Um, but 7 out of 10, uh, overall a pretty good experience. And uh, that's it for this video. I do make 8-bit music if you're into that sort of thing. And I've put a link in the video description down here. So uh, check it out if you like it. And if you don't know what it is, then you should check it out anyway. But yeah, that's it for this one. Um, see you guys next time. Bye.